and welcome. Now, I wouldn't normally bring you this battle axe, this sad sack of misery, Sheila Fogarty, from LBC, but I thought this was quite interesting. It is only a little clip, so I won't put you through it for long, and I won't have the video running, because copyright YouTube bar stewards. <laughs> The core is one, and I can behold the tide. Well, anyway, this was in regards to a phone call in regards to immigration. So I thought I'd uh, bring it to you because it does raise an interesting point at the end that I think we'd better discuss. The line at the moment it seems to be very much... Um, we have a problem with too many people coming in and affecting the you know, um, opportunities for people already here. They're, they're trying to either that other these people coming in, you know, and it's just it's revolting. It's revolting. Yeah, and, and it's it's almost honestly. I'm 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 fast becoming a supporter of the idea of an immigrant strike. Yeah. Every immigrant goes on strike for two yeah. days, just two days. Yeah. See how that works. Well, yeah. See how that works. Well, you notice how these swamp fraggles always talk about other groups as if they own them? I think all immigrants should leave and go, go on strike. Do you really? You don't speak for them. Stop trying. Now, at this point, I'd like to say, please do. Immigrant strike? Let's have a two-day immigration strike and let's find out just how much the country doesn't need immigration because that's what it would prove, wouldn't it? Let's make it longer, actually. I'm actually all for this. Let's make it a little bit longer. Let them strike for, say, a month. But in the same instance, because they're not paying in, because they're on strike, they shouldn't be getting any of the services either. So let's let them strike for a month and take away all of the services, like the NHS and the free money and the dole and the housing benefit and the council tax and all of the rest of the stuff they get for free that we have to work for. Let's do that and see just how much we actually do need immigration in this country because I guarantee it won't be what you're thinking it will be she's thinking all of these people when they go on strike the country's going to be knackered because they're not going to be able to have anybody serve them at Pret. Think I'm wrong on that let me know what you think. Sorry for bringing her to you but it was a quite an interesting one wasn't it? Stay sane I'll see you on the next one <laughs>